I'm Bert Sobel. Um, I'm chairman of the Department of Medicine at the University of Vermont and physician in chief at Fletcher Allen Healthcare, which is our teaching hospital. Um, of more importance with respect to the evening, I've had the privilege of being co chairman of the Council for the National Diabetes Education Initiative, or NDEI. Uh, which is really, really responsible for our being able to present the material ahead of us to you tonight. Now, from a personal point of view as a cardiovascular person, uh, the title of this symposium is extremely interesting to me because a few years ago when our own group got interested in the biochemistry of diabetic vasculopathy, particularly coronary disease, uh, we made some statements that caused the diabetologists to want to have us sent to Mars or some other convenient translocation place. The title of the symposium has a lot in it. It's type 2 diabetes that is a cardiovascular disease in the minds of many now. Now obviously type 1 diabetes is not a benign phenomenon with respect to heart disease, but there's a message in this title that type 2 diabetes is a cardiovascular disease. What's the diabetes part of it? Is it hyperglycemia? Is it high fatty acid? It's probably those things and many others. But it may well be that the real link to heart disease in type 2 diabetes is not what you and I, if we're cardiovascular people, are prone to leap at, blood sugar abnormalities. That may be a tip of an iceberg and in fact the underlying insulin resistance and other phenomena that the speakers will describe may be much more relevant to us as we have to deal with prevention and retardation of coronary artery disease. Now NDEI is an organization that's been trying to bring the message of improved care to physicians, nurses, lay public, many others for many years and it's sponsored by an organization called PPS, Professional Postgraduate Services, which is accredited by the Accreditation Council for CME. That's an important aspect of why we're here because that really means hands off. The speakers will say what's in their hearts and minds uh, without any manipulation from anybody. Support for the program is an unrestricted educational grant from Takeda Pharmaceuticals of North America and Eli Lilly. Now we're very lucky to kick off the evening with Dr. Steve Nissen who's Vice Chairman of the Department of Cardiovascular Medicine at the Cleveland Clinic Division of Ohio State University and Medical Director of the Cleveland Clinic Cardiovascular Coordinating Center in Cleveland. Uh, Steve is, is one of the genuine leaders in his field. Uh, he's going to talk with us about novel insights into atherosclerosis in the patient with diabetes, 